Uh, yeah. Did you watch that? The Amanda Knox documentary? No. Have you seen a picture of Amanda Knox's new boyfriend? No. Uh, you should pull it up, dude. He looks like... Uh, it looks pretty funny. He looks Kevin like the Federline. rapper... Uh, did you see looks how fat like, uh, Kevin what's Federline got? From G's to Gents. What's no. the guy? Oh, Riff Raff. Riff Raff. Yeah, yeah. Kevin Federline had a hilarious moment, dude. <laughs> like, yeah. that guy so overachieved what he yeah. should have had in life. <laughs> yeah, like, ultimate gold digger ever. Right? K-Fed. And he got out. Yeah. He doesn't have to be married to her. Now he can just get fucking alimony checks every month. I don't That's know. This guy just looks like a retard dumbass to me. There was one good picture. I don't know. There's one where he's it. wearing, like, zebra pants. He doesn't look like Federline. Not... Nah, Maybe it's just someone else. Who cares? Who cares? Fuck this. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, Federline got fat as shit, dude. Have you seen him? I haven't seen him recently, no. Although K-Fed. Britney's looking good. Britney is on so many drugs, dude. I don't give a fuck, she, they, Britney is just made out of evil Jew lawyers. <laughs> Look how fat. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I know. He got That is fat as hell. Yeah. Wow. He good got, for him. He, he K-Fed himself. <laughs> I'm sorry. I quit the podcast. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I quit. <laughs> yeah. I quit the podcast. <laughs> Yeah, he got fat as hell. He's still probably smashing whores, though. Probably. Oh, my God. I know. Oh, God. Kevin, dude. Yeah, he's fat. <laughs> Fucking idiot. Yeah, he really fell off. And he's mastered the big t-shirt immediately. Oh, yeah. It looks it doesn't look bad Some on people him. gain weight and they don't know how to deal with it. But he, he, he got fat the right way. I feel like <laughs> he was big T before he got fat. Yeah, but there's like a way to be a fat guy wearing a, a big t-shirt where it minimizes how much of a dumpy piece of shit sure, you are. Sure, sure. And he's nailed it. Yeah. Uh, yes. I tried that for years. No, you wear like, like tight shirts. Yeah, now that's my move. Yeah, I mean, embrace it now. Yeah, you want to. You want people to think you're a bowling ball. Uh, I don't think quite bowling ball is exactly what I'm going for. No, but, uh, no, like, like scary grizzly bear. Yeah, I'm like a sexy scary grizzly bear. Sexy and scary. I just want people to know that I'm I'm still I'm not defined by society standards, and if I want to wear a tight shirt, I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, good for you. Thank you. Um, for those of us that have to witness it, <laughs> we're like, oh, no, fuck. Dude, fat guys that wear Is the that a giant fan shirts? with uh, fantasy art painted on the side? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, it's a human being. Fat guys that wear the fucking uh, shirts just look even fatter, I find. Honestly, I'm jealous because you have a great shirt collection. I wish I wish the front of my shirt took up that much space. Yeah. So Availability. That, yeah, yeah. I, I could have that much going on on my shirt. Also, there's a lot uh, of canvas to work with. Right. Mm-hmm. You just have the entirety of Proust printed on the front of your shirt. Yeah, it's true. All I have fits. Guernica printed on my shirt. Yeah, Guernica. Col- that's right, bitch. We've been to the art museum. Yeah. You probably yeah. think we hadn't. We know uh, about Adam paintings. got yelled at by the security guard for flipping off a clock. <laughs> yeah. Remember that? That's yeah. yeah. We were Sir, do not do that. Really? I, fl- I yeah. flipped off a clock they get mad at you if you flip off the paintings and shit at the museum that's hilarious yeah get mad at the cleveland museum i went i was there last year and was that all just old episodes of drew carey show (laughs) yeah this is badass those little you know there's like movie theater rooms in the museum when you sit down and you're like oh this is gonna be cool okay this is gay shit (laughs) it sucks i just spent five seconds (laughs) pretending like whatever that video is is gonna be entertaining yeah you're just so happy it's something that's like tv (laughs) having to learn and fucking want to learn Anything, shit, dude. For a whole day. Let's go back to Air and Space Museum where <laughs> yeah. you can touch everything. Yeah. I'm glad that rock and roll really brought back the Cleveland economy. Oh, that museum sucks, dude. The yeah. rock and roll museum, dude. They have like Fallout Boy in there. <laughs> dude, <laughs> like that. Yeah. They have like the gayest <laughs> shit in there. They have like Kid Rock talk. They have videos of Kid Rock talking about Elvis. <laughs> it's fucking. <laughs> it sucks. So you were just hard. there? I was there like a year ago. A year ago. You're going back. <clears throat> I'm going back. Yes, I'm about to go on a little bit of a tour. I'm going this Friday. I'll be there. Where to Cleveland? Yeah, I'll be in Cleveland. Uh, for what? The Drew Carey show? Oh, the sorry, Drew Carey Memorial. I'm to get that reference in twice. <laughs> the Drew Carey Memorial. I'm playing Mimi in the Drew that Carey That was actually revival. a good show. It the was Drew good. Drew Carey show. Yeah. yeah, I dropped a Mimi Bobek re- reference recently and someone was like, whoa. Wow, that was like a deep cut. And it's like, what? Mimi? No. It's a sitcom. It was on for like seven years. It was on. It was on forever, dude. Yeah, might have been more than seven. It was Everyone crazy. knows who the fuck Mimi Bobek is. Everyone knows Mimi, dude. If you don't know who Mimi Bobek is, you're a fucking idiot. You're the asshole. Who right, is that? You know? I'm not. You don't know who Mimi is, dude. Mimi Bobek. Uh, uh, that was a Drew di- Carey. That was a. She was a former dictator of Romania, right? She was the first SJW. 
Oh yeah, yeah, Mimi with the, <laughs> yeah. the eyeshadow. You know, Mimi was just on Tumblr on that computer. Oh all day. my god! <laughs> Outside of Mr. Sheffield's office or whoever that British boss was. Yeah, it was, uh, it was Craig was, uh, Ferguson. Craig Ferguson. Yeah. Holy shit, Mimi was the first Tumblr bitch. Dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, pig. <laughs> So, do you not see yourself, me? Oh, that's incredible. That's exactly who the fuck she was. Yeah. Damn. That's a good one, boys. Yeah, that show was ahead of its time. They had they had uh, they had like Tumblr girls beforehand. Uh, Drew used to make beer in his backyard. He was like a that's craft right. brewery. That's right. Those guys. That's real popular yeah. in the Midwest. Um. Uh, uh. Fucking. Uh, Oswald drove for uh, Uber. <laughs> People forget that. that, yeah, that was he was part the of first the show. Uber. He was the first Uber guy. He drove Uber around. Wasn't uh, Ryan Styles of Whose Line of, Is It Anyway on that show? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, he was. Yeah. Did cool. you not watch the Drew Carey show at all? Sometimes. A little bit. It was a good I, show. That was my you know shit, what? It dude. seemed like they were all Cleveland having fun. Cleveland rocks. That's what, that was the appeal of that show. It seemed It's sort of like Come Town. It seems like everyone on Drew Carey show is friends and having fun. Definitely <laughs> a similar caliber. Absolutely, of, of, of joke writing, of writing. Yeah. yeah, well, I think so. As much thought went into yeah. that show as I don't know. Like they would have, I think they would have episodes that don't have better with like, jokes. You know, being but... like a middle class American, and like we're like, what if a retard was gay? <laughs> Which, by the way, <laughs> you said it as a joke, but it's hilarious. It's joke. Yeah, yeah. Hey, oh. <laughs> can I fuck your dick? <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Man, yeah. they need to let us have Jesus Mad TV. Christ. Just give us the show. <laughs> to get on, get on Twitter. We gotta chill. With hashtag all this fire shit. everyone on Mad TV and hire the cum boys. Yeah, we're doing hashtags now. Okay, so our jokes are smarter than Drew Carey show, but I think like the whole like the general vibe. I'm still laughing. About it. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah. <clears throat> so we'll have it. We'll bring back Stewart. Just pink stained sweat. Yeah. <laughs> 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 There's a pink helmet on. <laughs> He's got a juice smile, but but the juice smile has come. <laughs> He's just walking around drinking cum out of a sippy cup. <laughs> fuck, dude. I don't okay, know. Okay, fuck. <clears throat> I, think, uh, I think this is a rude joke. Shut the fuck up, because my father, Are you being woke again? <laughs> I'm woke now. I told you guys. I love to be woke. What were you saying? Your father's retarded and gay? And gay. <laughs> It's a, it was tough growing up. But then literally just <clears throat> you know Yes. Asking yes, exactly. If, asking if he could it call Bob the Builder. Here, right? Yeah, it is. What? It's hot, right? In here? Am I yeah. dying? I yeah. got a little bit of a fever going on I too. I think I do too. Yeah. You guys are sick? I'm a little yeah. sick. Yeah, I just don't feel it's like a general malaise. Mm-hmm. Well, that's just my life recently. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's what I want is a big a big sedan to drive around in and just be sick all the time. Just yeah. kind of sick. We should move to just Buffalo. Just sniffling and maybe, you know, throwing up in my mouth a little bit, but not fully and just driving my giant sedan around mm -hmm. town complaining. <laughs> like a cop. Like those kind of sedans? Like a grand... No, like a big... Yeah, like a big old... What are those things called? Grand Marquis? Yeah, like a grand... I used good. to have a grand marquee. Really? Those are good cars. Four grand marquee. 